I have these propaganda posters for your approval, sir. What? Are you kidding me? What are these? These are awful. Look at that font. Do you think anybody's gonna join me with this weak font? Get out. Not that anyone has a choice. To the gulag. Contact the secret department. Yes, sir. What should I ask for? I want to see the Politburo agenda. Yes, sir. I will make that call right away, sir. Here's the Politburo agenda. How are the executive's actions? Have the special party instructions been set out? This needs to be done now. Right away. And make sure this dossier gets filled out with, filed with the Comrade Card Index. Right away, sir. Hashkiba, talk to me. I conclude that there's been no security breaches. We've gathered all classified information. Long God, give it to me. The state is secure. The police, gulag, and special sessions of court are all proceeding as requested. And lastly, your regulations created to be used against the tried and convicted have been put into place. Good. This concludes our daily briefing session. Are you ready for your radio interview? Yes. Okay, some keyboards to remember, and don't get mad, but sometimes you can come across as cold and rude. Um, try to be warm and kind. You really want the people to like you. I'm Stalin. I know what to do. Don't tell me what to do. Okay, ready? Welcome to our show. Today we talk with our great leader, Stalin. So, discuss with us, why have you not used the army as a source of enforcement? I don't need the army. If anything, the army would be able to stop my regime. I don't need the possibility of a revolt, a resistance army. I control the people. Instead, I use terror, enforced by the GPU. Also, the KGB is my military service and it governs the army laws and regulations that I set forth. Through my demands, the foreign intelligence and counterintelligence are controlled, as well as the state borders are secured. They are the state security of my great nation. There's no need for an army. Well, sir, we definitely feel safe in your hands and we're glad you are our leader. It's hard to be Stalin. Our great leader Stalin. So discuss with us, why have you used you how I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I am not even